Hey everyone. Um, I just wanted to make this short video because I just had the oddest thing happen. And it might be nothing, it might be something. I don't know. Anyway, I came out here to get my mail later than usual because it's somewhere between 6.30 and 7 in the evening. Right here where I'm standing, I'm standing right in front of my bedroom window um, in the front yard. And over there where that power pole is to the right of your screen, there's kind of a, a drive. You can tell that people have been going up and down that hill. The grass is all tamped down. You can see tire tracks. And when I didn't notice it until I walked out to get the mail. And there was this fine, shiny black SUV sitting there with way tinted out windows, darker than what's legal in this area. And the man was just sitting there facing towards my house. And I could tell he was on the phone. And he had both windows rolled down. About the time I started back to the house, he took off. Well, I saw that our neighbors across the road there were out spraying either for weeds or for bugs, probably for weeds. So I don't think it had anything to do with them. That used to be their property, but I think they have sold it all. And I'm not quite sure why the man would be sitting over there or what kind of you actually, now that I look at it, you can see right in my bedroom window to the chair that I sit in in the living room. And I guess with a, a zoom-in high-powered lens, you could probably see me sitting there. Now, I talk about a lot of things with a lot of different people <coughs> about what's going on in this world and how I feel about most of it. Suffice to say, I'm pretty sure this is all psyop. But anyway, it is what it is. Um, I just want folks to know I am not suicidal by any stretch of the imagination. It's against my religion, for one thing. For another thing, um, I've got a loving husband, and I've got my four puppers that I absolutely do not intend to leave behind. So I will do everything in my power to make sure that I outlive them. I just thought it was really odd. It's not the first time. But it just struck me as really odd tonight. I mean, most of the time I'm not out here this time of night. Gosh, we've got dead grass all in my flower bed. I'm going to have to get out here and clean this out tomorrow. It looks terrible. Or mix it in or something. Well, anyway, anybody that spends any time around here knows that I've got a security team right here. That dog right there is not going to let anybody in my house. Which I'm sure if somebody wanted to get in bad enough, they'd just kill him. And if they kill him or any of the other ones, they might as well go ahead and kill me too. Because then it's on. Now, I'm just a 62-year-old woman. Former truck driver. Disabled. For the most part. I don't do much of anything except express my opinion about stuff. But we do have new neighbors that just happen to be military, imagine that, that don't seem to want to be real friendly. So I'm not sure, I'm not, I'm not sure. I'll definitely be keeping an eye out um, from now on. That just rattled me. Uh, since I got you on here, 
we had to, the new folks come out and do the yard mowing yesterday. Oh, this took so much work off of me. I wonder if I got a leak going on here. Ugh. Good grief. I can't even get the water turned off good. Doggone it. You're telling how long it's been running. Um, so they got all the weed eating done, all the mowing done, and all I've been doing is just coming out here and picking maters. So tomorrow, I've got a doctor's appointment, and then I'll come home and be putting up maters. i got carrots. I'll probably pick them, pick some more of them tomorrow because I'm making dog food. I don't know if these are doing anything. Let me pull one of these out and see if it's doing anything. No, they're not really doing much of anything. So I don't know if they'll live or not. But I got some green beans. I'll have to come out and pick. Looks like my lima beans are flowering again. Maybe I'll get something off of them, some more off of them. Since I took the netting off, and then get. Okay, got some green beans, just a few, but hey, a few will add up to a lot eventually. And they are good. We had them for supper the other night. One, two, three, four, five. There's five, five on there. I haven't checked the bus buckets back here. Peas aren't coming up yet. Oh, that's okay. Anyway. I don't know. That was just weird. And I don't think I'm being paranoid. I mean, I live out in the country. I know who, wh who's got what vehicles around here. And that was just weird. Okay, what do we got on this plant here? There's one. There's a couple. Oh, and there's a couple on that one. Well, hey, we got one serving. And the tomatoes are just making and making and making and making. So we're going to have some good mater sauce. Good skeddy sauce. Chili sauce when the weather gets cold. Thank the Lord for our abundant harvest. Thank you, Lord, for that. Thank you, thank you. Anyway, you know, I just figured I'd let my YouTube family know that if anything happens to me, I'm not suicidal. Y'all right. have a blessed day and a wonderful tomorrow. We'll see you in the morning with the Bible reading. Much love.